1938, Samsung started as a trading company in South Korea, selling groceries and dried fish. Fast forward to today, and this company is shaping the future of technology. But have you ever stopped to think about how a Samsung phone is actually made? Every time you swipe, tap, or take a photo, it's a result of thousands of hours of engineering and innovation. From raw materials to the sleek device in your hand, the journey of building a Samsung phone is nothing short of extraordinary. Stay with us because today we're going behind the scenes to uncover the incredible process that makes your smartphone come to life. Now, let's get to the good part. How exactly is a Samsung phone made? It all starts with an idea. Samsung doesn't just think about what people need now. They think about what people will need in the future. From there, a team of designers and engineers get to work, imagining how the next Samsung phone will look and feel in your hands. One, the design. The first step is always design. Designers sketch the phone on paper, working on the size, shape, and how it's going to feel when you hold it. You might not realize it, but the curve of the edges, the placement of the buttons, even the way the phone reflects light are all carefully thought out. Once the design is approved, it's time for something even cooler making it real. Two, sourcing the materials. Before Samsung can put a phone together, they need the right materials. Samsung sources materials from all over the world. Think about this, the glass for the screen, the metal frame, and the lithium for the battery might come from different countries. Samsung also makes sure the materials are strong enough to handle drops, scratches, and even the occasional splash of water. Most Samsung phones use Gorilla Glass, which is super strong and designed to resist cracks and scratches. For the insides, there are components like the processor, camera sensors, and storage chips, which come from Samsung's own factories and a few trusted partners. Now, with all these materials ready, it's time to move on to the next step. Three, manufacturing. This is where the magic happens, assembling all the tiny pieces together. In factories across the world, robots and humans work side by side to build the phones. The main factories for Samsung phones are in South Korea, Vietnam, and India. These factories are enormous, with rows of machines putting together thousands of phones every day. In one section, the chips are soldered onto the phone's motherboard. This is the brain of your phone, and it controls everything from running apps to connecting to the internet. Then the display is attached to those beautiful AMOLED screens that make Samsung phones stand out with their vivid colors and deep blacks. But what's amazing here is the level of precision. These machines can work with components so small that the human eye can barely see them. And they do it all at lightning speed. Four, the camera. Samsung phones are known for their incredible cameras and making them is a whole process on its own. The lenses are carefully placed into the phone along with tiny motors that allow for zooming and focusing. Then there's software magic Samsung engineers develop algorithms that make your photos look clearer, brighter, and more colorful. Here's a fun fact. Samsung tests their camera sensors by taking thousands of pictures in different lighting conditions. They even test them in near darkness to make sure your night shots come out perfect. Five, be testing, testing, and more testing. Before a Samsung phone is released, it goes through a ton of tests. They drop the phone from different heights, press the buttons thousands of times, and even bend the phone slightly to make sure it won't break easily. They also test the water resistance by dunking the phone in water and checking if it still works. Samsung also runs software tests to ensure everything runs smoothly. They open apps, play games, take photos, and browse the web to make sure the phone can handle whatever you throw at it. And it's not just humans testing the phone, Samsung uses robots too, simulating thousands of touches and swipes on the screen. Six, 
packaging and shipping. Once a phone has passed all the tests, it's ready to be packaged. This might seem like a simple step, but Samsung even puts thought into how the packaging looks and feels. They use eco-friendly materials for the box and everything is packed in a way that keeps the phone safe during shipping. The phones are then sent to Samsung stores and other retailers around the world. In some cases, they even ship directly to customers who pre-ordered them online. Imagine that your phone might have traveled thousands of miles before landing in your hands. 7. Software and updates. Even after you buy the phone, Samsung is still working behind the scenes. Their team of software engineers keeps pushing updates to make sure your phone stays fast, secure, and packed with new features. Samsung's One UI interface is designed to be smooth and user-friendly, giving you more control over how you use your phone. They also work on improving security so your personal data stays safe. And that's how a Samsung phone is made from a simple sketch to the powerful device you hold in your hands. It's a journey of innovation, precision, and creativity involving thousands of people across the world. Every part of the process, from designing the phone to testing it under tough conditions, ensures that when you pick up a Samsung phone, you're holding the best of modern technology. Next time you swipe through your apps or take a perfect selfie, remember the incredible work that went into making it all possible. From raw materials to cutting edge tech, Samsung phones are more than just devices. They're a piece of modern day engineering that connects the world. If you found this behind the scenes, look at how Samsung phones are made as fascinating as we did. Hit that like button and share this video with your friends. Got any questions or want to learn more about how your favorite tech is created? Drop a comment below and we'll dive into it in a future video. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss out on more awesome tech stories like this one. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next video.